Thank you for taking the time to watch this video on Medline's bath bench with arms. This segment is going to go through your bath bench contents. Ensure that you have all the necessary components before assembling your bath bench. If any parts are missing, do not use. Please contact Medline at 1-800-MEDLINE. Ensure that you have one bench, two aluminum mainframes, four aluminum extension legs, two reinforcement bars, two padded armrests, five hand screws, and one curved washer. This segment is going to go through setting up your MDS 897-40RWA bath bench with arms. Place the seat bench upside down on top of a raised flat surface. Insert the main frame with an A imprinted on it into the indentation on the underside of the bench with an A imprinted on it. Insert the main frame with a B imprinted on it into the indentation on the underside of the bench with a B imprinted on it. Secure the center cross section using the curved washer and a hand screw. Place the reinforcement bars across mainframes. Insert a hand screw through each end of the reinforcement bar and mainframe. Insert a leg extension piece on all four legs of the mainframe. Depress the push button and adjust each leg extension to the same heights on all four legs of the mainframe. Check that all push buttons fully protrude from the mainframe. Stand the chair upright. Insert an armrest on each side of the seat bench. Ensure the curved bar of the armrest extends outward from the bench. Depress the push button and check that the push button protrudes fully. This segment is going to show you how to adjust the bench to the proper height. While standing in front of the assembled bench, as if preparing to sit, the back of the user's knees should touch the seat bench. This should allow the user's feet to be firmly on the floor while properly seated. Adjust the leg extensions as needed by depressing the push buttons. Please check that the push button protrudes fully and that all leg extensions are adjusted to the same height. Ensure that all four tips rest evenly on the floor. This segment is going to describe the maintenance of your bath bench with arms. Prior to use, inspect the bath bench for damaged or loose components and ensure that all parts are secure. Check that all four legs are adjusted evenly. Check the tips on the leg extensions for rips, cracks, or wear. And check the bench for cracks or ruptures in the plastic. Please note, do not use bath bench if any of these are noted. Clean with regular household cleaning products. Use a non-abrasive cleaner with warm water. Do not use abrasive powders or scouring pads. This segment is going to state the general warnings for your bath bench. Prior to each use, check to ensure that all screws, joints, and fittings on the bath bench are tight. Check tips for rips, cracks, or wears. If these conditions exist, do not use the bath bench and replace the tips immediately. Check the bench for cracks or ruptures in the plastic. If you have concerns, contact Medline at 1-800-MEDLINE. Check that all push buttons are fully protruded from the main frame through the leg extensions and are properly engaged. Ensure all four legs are adjusted evenly and are free of any obstructions prior to use. When transferring in and out of unit, evenly distribute weight between the arm supports. Do not place bath bench on uneven surfaces. Do not use if wobbly, unstable, or not level. Do not exceed user weight capacity of 350 pounds or 159 kilograms. Do not stand on the bath bench. Do not adjust the leg extensions while seated on the bench. 
Do not twist or turn while sitting on the bath bench. This may cause damage to the frame. Do not use the bath bench for anything but its intended purpose. Use the arm supports only for assistance. Do not attempt to use the arms to support full body weight. If you are still experiencing difficulties, please contact the Medline Customer Service Center at 1-800-MEDLINE with any questions. Thank you.